that time, you know. Uh, but brother, brother Imam, I just like to thank you for the opportunity and thank you for the time and pray a lot to bless you with success and good health and uh, bless you with great understanding. I know you have great understanding and I, I'm just overwhelmed. But from my heart, I really want to try to make a contribution to the advancement of our Islam here in America. And I really want to do my best. And I appreciate any advice. <laughs> I know you said very safe. <laughs> yes, it is. That's uh, that, that, uh, my desire to uh, have this opportunity to be uh, to meet you in person. Okay. Uh, and as I said, uh, uh, the desire to uh, have this opportunity to be uh, to meet you in person. Okay. Uh, and as I said, uh, uh, the, uh, the presentation that you made, uh, in my opinion, is uh, very, very impressive. Uh, and I do believe that uh, you are not uh, uh, you are not uh, given uh, your uh, good wishes uh, to uh, the secret order, but you you are trying you are trying to uh, uh, bring bring them to question the, uh, the the value of secrecy that. Uh, the, uh, the the legitimacy of secrecy yeah. as they as they practice it, yeah. and um, I think it, to that extent you're serving the religion, you're serving the interests of the Muslims, you know. Um, uh, but as I said, that because of the the, the, the this very sensitive issue of uh, secrecy, masonry, and uh, be truthful with you. Uh, I don't. Uh, I don't uh, know if we have any uh, grounds to work against these secret orders, unless they practice something uh, that is a uh, uh, harm and detriment to the society of man. You know, I don't think we have we have, we have grounds to uh, to to uh, work against them or to or to work for the. Uh, in uh, termination of this yeah. kind of these kind of orders, you know, I don't I don't know if we have any anything to go upon, and uh, but I do know of a lot of good that many of them are doing, yeah. like the Masons, the the Lions Club, you know, those people yeah. like that. They do a lot of good, uh, but at the same time, uh, we we can't as Muslims, we can't. Uh, uh, Join them in secrecy. Okay. We can't join them in secret in secrecy unless it is the kind of secrecy that is approved by the Word of God and yeah. Quran for Muslims. You know, yeah. and you know what Allah said in the Quran that most secret secret uh, meetings for secrecy are no good, yeah. um, uh, and the only ones that are that are uh, worthy. Of uh, recognition, good recognition, are those where men come together uh, to promote good in society, to promote righteousness in society, to promote fair dealing between men. So that tells us that uh, we can have secret meetings, but our secret meetings m must have nothing in them that would be. Uh, Wrong, unfair for men, for, for any society, or for any for any people. You know, the intent has to be good, and our meeting together has to be for the for the purpose of advancing good, for the benefit of all people. You know, um, so I think some of these secret orders do feel that they uh, <laughs> qualify under that kind of description. You know, so that's why I say I'm, I, it's very touchy for me, okay. and I'm saying this to you in private. Yes, you know, okay. yes. Right. yes. Okay. I'm saying this to you in privacy. Uh, I wouldn't even want to have this uh, uh, published that I'm okay. saying. Okay, I would not. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Uh, uh, but you can publish that you met with me. Okay. And, uh, I appreciate that. And I wish you well. I, I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, uh, but you can publish that you met with me. Okay. I appreciate that. And I wish you well. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Alhamdulillah, our relationship, as with any good relationship, was built upon trust. And this was 1987, and although from that point on, several times he shared with the community uh, what he shared with me and told me to keep private, but I still never said anything. And it was only maybe about five years after his passing before I started sharing uh, this with the community. But I have no doubt it was based upon trust. Our first meeting, and he let me record it and told me to keep it private. And I never published it. I did do that. And as you've seen where he say, uh, no Mustafa and his sincerity, etc. So for all of us, what's important, trust in our laws, number one, but having trust among ourselves. So I just wanted to share this in light of that. I'm holding this with my hand, so you see it's shaking a little bit. I'm so like, 